YouTubers, this is Tammy again. I am blogging again. Um, I like blogging. It's kind of interesting to, you know, s let, let others listen to your, um, what your thoughts and what you're thinking. Um, it's actually getting really, really pretty excited because, um, my date is set. I'm excited because I've been waiting ooh, a long time. Um, like I said, my first other two blogs um, for this tummy tuck. And I have pictures that I, at my highest weight was like 213, I think it was. Um, I'm five foot eight between five foot eight and five foot nine, so I'm pretty tall. Um, but I could tell the weight was bearing on me. And I just felt miserable. Nothing felt right. Um, I just, I felt unhealthy. And really I was. Um, so I'm actually preparing myself for this tummy tuck. Um, haven't smoked any more cigarettes. Thank goodness. Um, don't get me wrong. I could have one right now. And wouldn't think about it. But I know for the healing process... You don't need to have nicotine. You don't need to smoke none because um, your scar will look horrible. I've seen it um, on YouTube and I was like, there's just no way. Um, I'm not going to do that to myself and mess up my stomach because of me. Um, it's just an old, dirty old habit that I think anybody pissed their mind to it can do it. I haven't had any all day long. See, I got gum. Um, you just start thinking about it, craving, pop piece of gum, pop piece of mint. Um, it'll help. It's done me all day long, don't get me wrong, I still have the cravings, but you know, um, I just keep back in my head that I have to have the nicotine out of my system um, before I have my tummy tuck, so. Um, I'm really excited. I'm ready to get this body to a certain extent back to the way I was before. Um, I'm actually don't want to be a Barbie. I just want to feel comfortable and um, and not sit down and feel like oh, there's a big roll and you can't suck it in because it won't go nowhere. So, whenever you sit down, you just have a flat, tight stomach. And, um, I'm ready to look for that. Because no matter what exercise I did, um, I had a previous C-section before, so those muscles are just cut. So, that muffin top that we all call it, just sits there. And especially when you're wearing cute, tight, um, leggings like I wear, I love them. <clears throat> so, certain times that you just look down and just like a big old hunk of meat, um, that I think is just disgusting. So, um, but anyway, I have probably, I think, um, four weeks left. And, um, I go to meet my doctor, um, March 23rd, um, you know, to do the evaluation, I guess, and talk to me, you know, probably what I need to pick up and buy to have at home before the surgery and stuff so I do that on the 23rd and I think I'll probably do my um get to the hospital I guess that after that appointment and you know get everything set up um what I have to pay for the, pay to them because it's two separate whatever bills that I have to do but um so I'm I'm ready if I, if I could do it tomorrow I would but time and it's meant for me to have it on that date, so that's the date that I'm having it, March 28th. So, um, like I said, if anybody who views my vlogs and wants to leave any comments or feedback that's had tummy tucks before, um, that will, you know, that I haven't seen on YouTube yet, please do it. I would read them and, um, and be glad to, um, give me advice and help, um, because there's other things that when people have the tummy tucks, it affects differently. Um, people don't have the same thing. So that's why I've been, you know, YouTubing a lot. So I can, you know, check out the videos um, and getting some advice. Um, just listen to their videos and how they go through it. Through post-op one day, just two, all the way up to three to six months. 
So some average were about the same and some were different. So, and people deal with pain differently. Everybody's not the same. So one person can say it's the worst and the other person says, oh, it's not that bad. So just according, like I said, on the persons on their body of, you know, how they're going to deal with the pain. So, but please leave comments. Um, like I said, if you had tummy tucks before, um, if there's anything that I haven't heard of, please leave it because I will read it and take the advice because it all helps. Um, so, but thank you. I will be back. Um, I have to be at the hospital on the 28th early that morning, like I think at six o'clock. My surgery is not until 8 a.m. that morning. So I will have a video, um, before I go to the OR. And then when I get home that afternoon, I promise I will, um, do another video. Um, and hopefully I can get to see my stomach. Um, that's one thing I want to see. I want them, I want them to take it off, and I want to see what that thing looks like. I want to. I don't want to wait for a week, um, till I go see him, and then oh, this is your belly. Because I don't think I can wait. So, but I will post, and then I will keep posting as I'm healing, um, how I'm feeling. Um, so, thank you. Um, for watching my videos um and like i said please leave comments this if you have the tummy tucks because i will be glad to have the comments to kind of give me some feedback on things too so um it was great and hopefully keep my fingers crossed no more cigarettes i just keep looking at them videos that i saw with the scission even after 11 days post-op 10 days post-op I've seen some five days post-op. They look awful. Um, and even after a, almost a year, the scar was just tremendously... The stomach looked great, but the scar looked horrible. Um, I don't want that for me. I want... I have a cesarean scar right now, and you can barely see it. And it's been um, almost 15 years. That's the kind of scar that I want. It's going to be a little bit longer from hip to hip because I'm having an extended tummy tuck with um, lipo the flanks. So um, I keep looking at that video with them scars to keep me saying, oh, let's pick them up because that's what's going to happen. And you will look just like that. <laughs> so I keep telling myself that. So um, I will be back. And it was great talking to everyone. And I will see y'all soon. Hopefully at the end of March. That's when I'll be back. So talk to y'all later. Love you. Bye.